Hi guys. Let's put together a Christmas card. My card base is off a little bit. The standard A2 is when folded four and a quarter by five and a half. For some reason, I cut this card base at eight and a half by five and a quarter, scored at four and a quarter. I don't know where what made me decide to cut that quarter inch off, but I did. So that's what we're working with. I have this mat that goes on the outside. I have it cut at four and an eighth by five and an eighth. Then I have a little shaker window that's going to go on top of it that's cut at four and a half by four and an eighth. And the oval that's cut out of it is a two and a half inch oval, but I'm putting the oval back in there because I want it as the background, but because I'm doing a shaker, I needed it cut out. So it's going to go back in there. I'll find its proper location here in just a minute. Probably right around that area. Then on the inside I have two mats. The first one's cut at four by five and an eighth, and the second one is cut at three and three quarter by five. I have the sentiment, just plain old Merry Christmas, stamped out on white. I bannered the ends, both ends, and then I backed it on red and bannered the ends of that as well. Then I have these adorable little penguins out of a stamp set that I bought some time back, and I don't even remember where I bought this stamp set from. It's probably eBay, but it has all these cute little penguins on it. So I decided to use this guy and this guy, colored them up in mostly colored pencil, but also some gel pen, not gel pens, uh, journaling pens that I have. The shaker bits that I'm using, I ordered off of Ally Express. I got these micro beads. Then I have these that are seed beads and sequins, and they look really pretty. But I also, year before last at Target in the dollar spot, I bought these reindeer sequins, and frankly, I keep forgetting that I have them. They're going to go in my shaker window with my little white snow. So this should be pretty easy and pretty quick to put together. On my shaker window, I used three layers of foam this time. I'm just going to lift it up and put some glue underneath it and rotate it, lift it up and put glue underneath it because otherwise I'll fiddle with it again for 10 more minutes. There we go. And it really doesn't matter how much I put in this window because I'm not putting a sentiment or anything in there. I'm just putting sequins.
I'm not going to pop these up because I put three layers of foam on that mat, like I said, on this guy, on the shaker mat, window, whatever. And that little pink one there, where his eyebrows are raised, on the stamp he doesn't have any eyeballs. He just has raised eyebrows. I'm going to put him kind of cattywampus. See, he doesn't have any eyeballs. So I drew those in with just a black sharpie fine, fine tip and then used a white gel pen on it. Where am I going to stick the little heart? Maybe in the center of one of those snowflakes? Like right there. That's cute. There you go. guys let me know what you think. Thanks for spending a little bit of time with me. I certainly appreciate it. I hope you guys have a great day and a glorious tomorrow. Bye guys.